Okay, one of my students asked how would we set if we wanted to set up a default route. So we took router 1 here and we set a route to get to the 96 network over here, which is the network that this router, router 1, doesn't know about or didn't know about because it knows about its two connected networks but not this other network on the other side of router 2. But what if uh, you just said, hey, all default routes, if the router doesn't know where it's at, just go this way, right? Just head out the serial interface that way. So a default route going that way. How would you do that? Well, I can show you two ways to do it. Once with one with the command line, and then um, let's do it with the command line. That might be a good way to do it. Okay. First of all, I'm going to type in exit here. Hopefully you can see this. Um, and I'll type exit again. So here's what happens if you just fire up the router and go to the command line interface. Hit enter, and you get a router prompt. Uh, no passwords are configured right now. So just uh, the commands will take you to the next interface. So to get to the privileged exec mode you type enable and hit enter and then you get to privileged exec mode. Then to go to global config mode you type configure space terminal and that gets you to global config mode. And then if you wanted to put a static route um, you would do it this way, a default route uh, rather, uh, a default route uh, IP route IP space route space to the 0, .0, 0.0.0, .0 network space to the 0, .0, .0, .0 subnet mask and then in this case what I'm going to say is instead of saying the next top IP address what would be faster would be to just go out of your serial uh, space to slash zero interface so I'll say to all other networks to the zero networks meaning all other networks out of zero subnet mask go out of the serial 2 slash 0 interface and then hit enter and um, if you don't get an error message that means the route took so now I'll type in exit and then I'm in privileged exit mode I can say show space IP space route which will show me my routing table and you can see I have um, a static route now to the 96 network but then I have another static route with an asterisk which the meaning means it's a default route to the zero network out of my serial 2 slash zero interface and so that's how you would do that and then to s save your configuration you would say copy running dash config space startup dash config and that's the long uh, the full it's the full command, no shorthand there. And then you hit enter. Uh, and then you hit enter again to accept the default uh, file name. And it builds the configuration, and you're all set. So now I have